a young boy, he's 14 years old, he's from the Sudan. He was born with a relatively rare bile duct problem. The bile duct leads, lets the bile come out of the liver. And he started showing signs and symptoms of liver failure. And we're able to quickly make the determination that he was in need of liver transplant. He arrived in Abu Dhabi with two potential donors, his mother and his older brother, and we chose the brother as a more suitable living donor for the recipient. Alhamdulillah, يعني إنه أم تدخل اثنين عملية دي ماشي سهل لكن الحمد لله وإن شاء الله تكون لحظات بس تكون خير إن شاء الله. Montesquieu living donor liver transplant required the coordination of two surgical teams, one for the donor and one for the recipient. This was a fairly complex operation due to his size. He's only 14 years of age. We required the use of the left lobe of the liver of the donor. Since we didn't have the option of only two donors, there was complex reconstruction of the vascular anatomy. Montesir's portal vein had atrophied, which required its replacement with a vein graft. So overall, the liver transplant procedure took in the order of 10 hours. We took out 35, 37% of the brother's liver in one operation. The first step in the recipient is to take out his old liver and to prepare all the plumbing, which is quite complex, so that the new liver can be placed in him safely. Allah, first of all, I was in the house, alhamdulillah. I asked her, did you get a little bit? She said, yes. Did you get a little bit? Yes. Most of the time after the transplant, they feel like there is a new light in the room, especially in a kid like this that has been sick for basically all his life is going to be a real life changer. The coordination, the ability to plan and execute the operation, there was absolutely a minimal bleeding, and the donor has done very well from an anesthesia standpoint. So we're very satisfied about the outcome. Previously, liver transplantation was not routinely available in the UAE. Patients had to travel abroad to undergo a very complex operation. This often meant spending months away from home. It's a unique opportunity and a tremendous example of a collaboration between Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi and Cleveland Clinic Ohio. Seven weeks after his surgery that he's recovered completely, he's expected to go home, uh, return back home to his family in Sudan very soon, and continue to grow and live life to its fullest potential. We will continue to follow his care along with his physicians in Sudan to optimize his medical care given the lifelong need for immunosuppression. والله الوالد الله يحفظها ويطول عمرها يا رب العالمين تكون جنبي والله اكثر اكثر شخص وكيف جنبي ال 14 سنه هذه في مرضي والله واشكر الاخ الكريم يعني ما بفرق يعني احسها زي ملكي شكرا يعني حياه جديده وفرصه جديده ان شاء الله